Hey, what's going on? Hi, I hope everyone's having a really good day today. Woo! Woo! Hi, I'm Elisa. I'm the community manager for Disney Magic Kingdoms. Michael, uh, game designer on Disney Magic Kingdoms. Uh, Rebecca, game designer on Disney Magic Kingdoms. Welcome, welcome to our live stream to reveal the biggest uh, update coming up. And, well, I mean, as you can see, and a lot of you have been following us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram and looking at our teasers and whatnot. And you guys all figured it out. It's Frozen! Woo! Yeah, we made it a little bit too easy for them <laughs> uh, in the end there. But uh, everybody from the beginning, they were pretty adamant as, as to whether or not it would be Frozen. Mm-hmm. And um, we have an exciting uh, live stream to show you guys what is coming up with this update. But first, we do have a big announcement uh, that will be announced at the end of the live stream. Uh, you guys don't want to miss out. It's a huge announcement. Again, you don't want to miss out. All right, so let's get started. Um, what are we showing today first, guys? I think first we should definitely show off some of the awesome work that our team has done to bring winter. Oh, awesome! Look at to snowman. your kingdoms. Ooh. A bit of a holiday and festive spirit here with uh, some snow, some trees, some lights, some nice. snowmen, some lovely peppermint. Decros oh. there, and even the water has been frozen mm. along the circly path of the castle. Wow, circly. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, so that's something that I think is is really cool, and uh, you'll get to see that in your mm. parks when you update. That's awesome. Let's uh, maybe take them around as we continue talking about it, just to kind of show them some of the stuff. Oh, here. look at those candy canes! They're so cute. Yeah. Yep. Oh, nice. That this holiday tree. This is a nice tree. spot, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. That's a nice holiday tree. And, uh, we've oh, got some oh. cool stuff over there. Oh, but, oh, oh, yeah. oh, oh, oh. We're not ready yet. Right. Move on. Okay. So, um, a bit of a teaser. so we do have a uh, small announcement about the player level, um, maximum level. Uh, so right now the current level is 50, I think. Right? 50, 50 51. 51. Um, and now we're increasing that cap to level 61. So you guys can uh, enjoy more leveling up and gain more experience and have more magic and whatnot. Actually level 60, um, so oh. we're, we're stopping it there. Ah, so, sorry, yeah. 60. <laughs> All right, and now we should show them the costumes. The new costumes have arrived to Disney Magic Kingdom, so let's yep. show them. Um, we only have two costumes that are going to be uh, here for the holidays. Uh, both of these are time limited. Mm -hmm. uh, so we have Mickey in his holiday costume. And of course, if you're gonna have Mickey, you have to have Minnie. Mm. Who's currently locked, but yes. <laughs> yeah, so you need to have Minnie um, at level three um, yep. in order to unlock her beautiful holiday drink. Uh, I mean, costume. Sorry, I was thinking there was. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's awesome. But um, as Rebecca did mention, they are time limited, so you have to get both of them before the event ends. Yeah. Um, They're the but... only two costumes for this event, so there's only the Mickey and Minnie one. And we should go ahead and show them uh, an animation in, in the Mickey costume. So let's uh, let's go ahead and create that costume. Yeah, Mickey and Minnie uh, costumes for the holidays come with amazing animation. So you guys mm -hmm. don't want to miss out on these. And also, just to clarify things, Minnie is not required oh, for you to you complete the event. You do not have to collect her costume. Right. It's a purely optional thing. Wait for him to walk a little it's bit. Me, Mickey. There you go. <laughs> and uh, we'll go with the build a snowman, it, which. Mickey then begins building his own snowman. There. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, uh -oh his nose no. fell off. <laughs> <laughs> Mickey's having some difficulty just trying to get that character to <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's amazing, guys. All right, cool. So now we should show them the blue quests that are related to the yeah. Frozen event. Let's talk a little about, a little bit, uh, about the, uh, the Frozen event that's coming up. Obviously, if you're familiar with uh, The Incredibles and the Nightmare Before Christmas events, uh, which we ran. Um, they had special quest frames in your quest log there uh, that you see on the left side of the screen. And this one, um, a light blue uh, frame with a, a bit of uh, snow and seasonal accent there. Um, so yeah, keep an eye out for those as those are time limited quests that you can only complete during the event and uh, they're kind of the uh, the chain to getting the time limited content that's available uh, during this period. Oh, mm -hmm. I think I just saw a visitor walking by. Oh, there's oh, another one oh. with our new concession. They might stand have a, items. a new beverage in hand, which uh, <laughs> we show the community. Awesome. 
Um, so let's talk about the event uh, currencies. So event currency is at the top there in the middle. Uh, it's the Arendelle Shield, okay. right, Rebecca? Mm -hmm. So the Arendelle, Arendelle Shield, uh, and you'll have to collect those in order to um, welcome event-specific content. So welcome um, frozen characters or create the uh, holiday costumes. And you'll also have to collect it to, of course, uh, purchase the, the, the uh, frozen attractions. Yes. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Uh, should we show them the event hub that yeah. it will be introduced to you guys? Let's uh, take a peek into the event hub. Alright. There's been a little bit of a change, which uh, I'll let Mike kind of guide you through. Yeah, so um, we have uh, a number of characters here in the hub. Uh, a little bit different from what you previously saw, but along the same lines. Uh, instead of just their full bodies, since we had more, we, um, we chopped them up and uh, and gave you the full view of all the characters that you can kind of uh, get in terms of the um, the event storyline. Of course, mm -hmm. Minnie's costume is involved as well, but it's not part of the uh, the direct storyline for the event, so uh, she's not included in the home tab. But um, as you see in the bottom right, we have uh, two premium characters as well in uh, Olaf and Sven, and uh, they're really useful in terms of helping with uh, certain things in the event um, that we'll touch on later. Many of them characters, but you might see a familiar uh, figure there in a snogi, which um, keep your eyes out for and, and we'll touch on in, in a bit. Um, of course, the event goals that we had uh, for the last one, not going to show you too much in here, but uh, there's a lot of uh, new cool quests in here that uh, basically are your milestones for the event. Um, so uh, visit this tab if you have uh, any questions as to what's coming up next in the event and, uh, and what you'll be looking forward to. Um, yeah, so these are like your main milestones. Obviously, there will be some other quests that will lead up to these points. Yeah. Um, these are just to let you guys know what what the main key points of this event is. Yeah, so there's there's not necessarily one thing that leads to another in this tab, but uh, it's, as Elisa said, the main thing. So there might be things in between that you have to complete um, to get to the next milestone. But as it says there at the bottom, um, to get to that next milestone, just com keep completing more of those blue quests that are in your log, and you'll eventually reach that point. Awesome, and if you have any questions, um, there's a FAQ at the bottom, and you can also contact customer care for any assistance during the event. Of course, we also have uh, leaderboards, which uh, we don't have running at the moment, but uh, keep an eye out there for time-limited mini-events that will be running uh, during the Frozen event for uh, special rewards and content that is only accessible during the event as well. Cool. All right, so let's move on to the snow geese. Snow geese. Right. So why do we need snow geese, first of all? Let, uh, uh, hold on, let's show them the snow geese first. All right, let's, well, uh... I think what I'll probably do is just give a little bit of a okay. backstory of what is exactly mm -hmm. happening in this situation, which will make sense of the snow geese appearing. So uh, as you can see, winter has kind of come to the kingdom. Uh, and it seems all fun and games at first, but you know, Mickey starts to notice that the weather is getting a lot worse and it's not clearing up at all. And so as a result, uh, we have our wonderful Frozen characters show up, uh, Elsa showing up and worrying about the uh, what's going on in the kingdom too. So she goes off to try and figure out what's happening. Um, so one of the effects uh, of this snowstorm that's going on is the snow geese are running around the kingdom as well. And here we have really, one. Really fun, cool walk. Around <laughs> I love it's their walk. They're so yeah. cute. <laughs> All right. Um, so let's. Uh, we'll, we'll kind of do the flow of the quest here. So basically, um, similar to let's say the uh, the robots in um, the Incredibles event or. Uh, the spiders. The spiders in yeah. the nightmare event. Uh, mm -hmm. You'll be able to use the go button here to redirect to one um, and find one in the kingdom. So that one snapped onto this one here. Yep. Uh, note that also if there are none left in the kingdom, um, this is a special quest. It is an infinite quest. This quest basically uh, is not a quest to be completed. Um, it remains in your quest log once you've activated it uh, for the duration of the event. Uh, basically, as you'll see when I access the snowy here, um, the snow geese are your key for obtaining the uh, the frozen snowflake. Uh, and common the common token. The frozen snowflake is the common token for all of the frozen characters. So you'll need that to welcome certain frozen characters and to level all of them up. Mm -hmm. um, and you can also use it as a way of grinding for currency as well too. So. Mm -hmm. As you see, it also drops. Yeah, as Rebecca mentioned, event currency and uh, and a bit of experience too. So. Um, as you can see here, uh, we have three characters. Um, you only need to select one of the characters to clear a snogi, uh, or to capture a snogi, uh, but the character also has requirements to capture the snogi. So we have uh, a requirement here in um, bags and in rope. 
uh, or string, and uh, we'll, we'll show you what that's used for in a second. Uh, but I can select any one of these characters if I have the character and if I have the requirements uh, or if I obtain the requirements to capture that Snowy. So let's go ahead and send uh, Anna. Purchase those missing requirements, and, and she'll go over uh, with her bag and her string uh, to capture the snowy. Oh, oh, and oh no! It's unfortunately, <laughs> have to be behind, but we'll move this building. <laughs> oh, that's so cute! So that we can see what's going on there. Nice. So as you can see, they're trying to basically um, corral and, and re grab all of the snowies that are running wild in the kingdom. Yeah. That's adorable. We'll go ahead and show them the capture there yeah. uh, and just okay. skip it here. As you see, uh, it does drop the token there. It says chance, but it's a common, so it's a very high chance. Ah, oh, there it is. And, and she captured it, and there, of course, the common token, the frozen snowflake dropped. Awesome. So you do need these uh, snowflakes in order to walk them all uh, frozen characters. Yep. Yeah. Uh, let's just go in there one more time um, by tapping on a snowy. Uh, you can also hit that question mark button to bring up some quick tips mm -hmm. about uh, the snowy quest. Um, also, our new tutorial screens as well. They're available in all of the different sections in the game. Yep. Anytime you see that question mark, you can tap it and you can see these brand new tutorial screens which oh. will help you have a better idea as to how to do everything. Yeah, really cool new tutorial cards that the team worked on uh, that are in all of the places that tutorial cards were in before. Um, and this time they are a little bit more elaborate and have uh, some more important information, uh, useful tips for, for everyone to kind of Fantastic. take a look at. All right, so next is the attraction. So we kind of showed you guys a little overview, a little passing, but here's one of them. This is the uh, ice palace mm -hmm. uh, that you get to build when you welcome on, uh, Elsa. Uh, really cool attraction. Mm -hmm. yep. As you see, there's some uh, frozen storm lanterns there as well. Uh, oh, beside yeah, it. That's, uh, very nice. A cool nice. new lamp decoration that we have in the kingdom mm -hmm. during the frozen event. And there's the Arendelle yeah. ice rink. Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh, skating one? But it's a courtyard. Mm-hmm. Look at all those visitors, like, skating around. I think she's about to do a twirl. Oh. Let's see here. Oh. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Woo! Super pro. Point ten. Nine? <laughs> ten. Okay. That was flawless. <laughs> okay. And she's doing it on shoes. That's... There are no skates. <laughs> That's amazing. Well, this is a magical place. Yes. It is a very magical place. Okay. And, and there's also a nice bench there, uh, a, a cold seat for the visitors. <laughs> mm. Yeah, and we have other uh, attractions too that you guys can unlock during the event, so check those out as well. Yeah. Alright, so next we have the, uh, we want to show you guys the characters. Well, just oh. a, a couple of other small things before oh, we move on sure. from attractions. There's also uh, two new concession stands that uh. you might be familiar with here. Uh, one is an ice cream stand that the visitors can go uh, and obtain ice cream from and this is very helpful because uh, it, it's useful for obtaining event currency mm -hmm. during the event and uh, as we mentioned before there were visitors walking around with a beverage and that new beverage is hot chocolate mm. that you can obtain from another concession <laughs> stand that also drops event right. currency during the event. So. I really like how the marshmallows keep like bobbing up in the back. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> really cool. Alright. Alright. So uh, now characters. Some characters. Absolutely. Alright. So, I don't know, which one should we start with? Mm. Let's think... show them maybe Olaf? Oh yeah, let's totally show Olaf. So, let's, let's uh, level him up first. Um, That's a good idea. Yeah, here so here he we have. Check out this uh, welcome your level up animation here. It's, yeah, uh, the, really once cool. again, the animators just seriously outdid themselves. A lot of the animations are very adorable for this. There we go. <laughs> Oh my god, <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, that's there awesome. Amazing. That's Olaf and... One of his quests that you'll see if you welcome Olaf. His sto the story quests are amazing too, guys. So if you like to read these stories, like, please do. Like, they're amazing. Sully won't Sully uh, get out of the like... way. So we'll <laughs> Olaf. Olaf is like, no, I'm going to hide behind him. <laughs> <laughs> Olaf, buddy. Oh, almost there. All right, you can probably get him. Huh. Is he in a... Hmm. Having some trouble there. Hold on. Careful, no, no. demonstrate my karate chop. Here I am. Negatory. <laughs> I blame Sully. I totally blame Sully. But look how Olaf is interacting with the kids too. Like he's just making everybody happy. Yeah. 
Let's send him off on a nice summer walk. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> he tripped! So oh, that's adorable. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Cool and maybe another character you could show. Oh, let's see. Let's maybe go with uh, Anna. Anna. <laughs> Very nice. Her welcoming is really cool as well. Yep. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> nice skip and a jump there. So I think it'd be cool actually to show off a uh, nice group animation that we have with her and Kristoff. Mm. This uh, exploring activity, the group activity is, yeah, as Rebecca mentioned, a really cool one for the two of them. So, oh, okay. <laughs> so here we have them Kristoff. going exploring, trying to Pulls find their map. way. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> so I'll let them do that, and I guess we'll show the character maybe that everyone really wants to Which see. Which is... So, it's another predicament for me. I keep, um, oh, well, LCS. I, I want a different character. Oh, I know which one you're thinking of. Okay, we can definitely show that one right after. <laughs> um, but let's level Elsa up and show you guys what she looks like. This is my favorite. <laughs> Oh, that's amazing. Really oh, that's cool. so cool. <laughs> I loved it. All right. We'll show uh, one of her, uh, her activities. Mm -hmm. Also, I love her walk. Yes, if you notice, uh, the ice is forming right behind her as she walks. Yeah. So I believe... Send her to the uh, the ice palace. Yes. Um, it's at the very end. Here I stand. There we go. There she goes. Let's... Yeah, so it's the, you know, the ice is forming right behind her as she walks. Yeah, the trail. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thankfully, it doesn't seem to be affecting the kingdom quite the same way it did in the film. <laughs> <laughs> there she goes. Into the ice palace. Really cool. And if you go in a little bit closer, you can see oh. her wonderful expressions right there. Yep, and just the snowflake too that forms over yeah. top. Mm. Oh, that's beautiful. All right, so let's show Mike's- Let me do this one, let me do this all one. Right, all right, This is Mike's <laughs> favorite character now. I have a bit of an issue because each event, I have a new favorite. Um, I started off with Pluto, mm -hmm. and then uh, Zero, Zero took the reins. Mm -hmm. uh, but now, that's true. I was quite impressed Zero took when the you... reins. <laughs> My new favorite, which I, I think is going to be a, a crowd favorite as well. Uh, yeah, this <laughs> oh, and look at his tail! That's so cute! He's so really cute. Really cool. <laughs> yep, and a nice high five as well. Oh, that's adorable. Can we show Sven's like animation? Yeah, let's uh, let's show one of Sven's activities. Awesome. Just look at that trot. It's amazing. A nice gate. Mm -hmm. Oh, I had some trouble accessing it. Oh. oh, there he is. There we go. Yep. So, which one should we do? Oh, uh, uh, we, I think Kristoff's busy right now. No, we, we can, can skip, skip it. it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. We'll, uh, we'll show them this one. It's a really cute scene, guys. I really like it. I mean, it. like, if you're going to show a Sven animation, it should be one that also involves Kristoff. Mm -hmm. They are the best of friends. Mm -hmm. I agree. There it is. There we go. Oh! <laughs> so they need a, I think they just need a room? Specific, a bit, yeah. A bit of space, yeah. yeah. So uh, they go to a certain area in the kingdom. There it is. Oh. <laughs> and uh, got some, Sarah needs his friend. Some musical stuff going on there. Because really cool. reindeer are better than people. Uh, of course. Of course. <laughs> cool. One more thing mm -hmm. before we forget. We, of course, have a new parade float for you as well. Awesome. Um, frozen parade float. Some of you awesome. might be familiar with the... Uh... Might recognize. <laughs> yeah, so the frozen float really helps you with the event as well as it drops uh, several tokens that you may need yeah. for Tokens event. and event currency. Oh, event currency. And of course, a chance for gems too, which is uh, mm -hmm. something that everybody likes. Everybody loves gems. Gems, gems, gems. 
Oh, that's awesome. Really cool. That's really cool. Alright guys, so that's pretty much it for the uh, live stream. So I know a lot of you have been asking for land expansion. Um, so as we've been mentioning in our patch notes from our Halloween uh, we want to release more lands obviously, um, it's just that we're focused more on optimizing our game for uh, better play for you guys so that the graphics and animations are all up to high standards that we really want to show you guys. Um, so until we uh, optimize it to the fullest, uh, we're, we'll be a little bit slow with the land expansion. However, with this update, we do have a land that will be available to unlock for you guys uh, in this area right here. Um, that you guys can unlock this patch. All right. Um, again, we, we will be releasing more lands in the future. We just want to optimize the game so that you guys can enjoy a quality uh, game experience. All right. Okay. And one last thing, just one last thing. This is the big announcement that we wanted to tell you guys about. Um, so we, during this special winter event, we want to release this amazing contest where you guys can uh, progress to the event and qualify to enter these uh, contests where we will be giving away Olaf's fan, gems, all that cool stuff. Um, so basically, we'll be releasing more information on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram today. Uh, but basically, when, as you unlock these characters like Anna, Kristoff, um, uh, Elsa and come uh, progress through the boss battle scene uh, against you know who um, you can qualify to enter these contests by entering your screenshots with a specific hashtag um, that you guys will have to use to enter these contests uh, again more information will be posted later today but it's a really cool contest I hope you guys will like it all right I know they're gonna do a great job Oh, I'm totally. looking forward to seeing some of the submissions. Mm -hmm. That will be really cool. So get your stuff ready, you know, get ready for Winter Wonders event and we'll see you soon. Uh, we won't be telling you when the event is coming yet, but it's soon. I it's coming soon. 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 So keep your devices ready. Mm -hmm. yep. Level up those characters, you know, make some space for these amazing attractions. Let's get ready for Winter Wonders event, guys. All it's right. really exciting. Thanks for right. tuning in. Take care, everyone. Bye! Super excited for this. I'm too. very excited. Yeah. <laughs>